थे ये आप ही Oh hey sis I just finished my questionnaire and was about to collect responses do I really need this IRB thing Oh you're not playing street cricket anymore but you can make your own rules you're playing the research world cup you better level up Look IRB approval is your match referee it makes sure that your research game is strong ethical fair and not endangering you or your participants Remember this you need an IRB approval if you're collecting data from human participants If you're asking sensitive or personal questions, if you're using questionnaires or surveys, or even if you're working with vulnerable participants like minors or patients, ask yourself: Am I conducting a research? Are human participants involved? If yes, then you definitely need an IRB approval. But Abi, it's just a student project. Even in net practice, you wear a helmet. IRB is that helmet. It protects you before the bouncer hits. And if you feel that you don't need an IRB approval letter, apply for an exemption. If you don't get an IRB letter, your paper can be rejected or worse, it can be retracted after publication. All this effort and you can be run out without facing a single ball. Apply for an IRB before you start data collection. It's not a delay, it's part of the game plan. But how do I apply for the IRB? Subscribe now and I'll tell you in my next video.